I'm Wayne Potratz. I'm uh, from Minneapolis, Minnesota. I'm a sculptor. Uh, I'm a professor emeritus from the University of Minnesota. Uh, I taught there in the Department of Art for 45 years. And mainly I taught metal casting and metal work, as well as other sculpture classes, seminars. Uh, in the late 90s, I traveled to Japan. I spent a lot of time studying uh, Japanese metal work, especially metal casting. And, uh, and there I confronted uh, the, the smelting in a process called the tata, Tatara, the Japanese furnace for making uh, steel and iron. And so um, I spent some time studying that and uh, I invited some Japanese to come over to do workshops at the University of Minnesota. So I've been smelting um, Minnesota magnetite iron ore for about 20 years now uh, to make high carbon steel. And as a sculptor, I've done, I've made some knives, but mainly I use it in my work, often in a raw form rather than in a finished building form. So the class is, um, is called the kind of Viking era smelting, and the, the furnace that we're running today is called a Norse short stack. It's, Kind of a short, uh, small uh, furnace. It's maybe about uh, 40 some inches high, and it's made out of brick and clay. We we use brick; it's just faster to build it. We also, the day before, we built a brick hybrid, which is kind of a hybrid of a Japanese furnace, and ran that. So yesterday we made about 30 pounds of uh, metal. Uh, we're not sure what it is yet, whether it's high carbon or cast iron or low carbon or what it is because we have to break it up, which we'll do on Thursday. Today we're doing another smelt, uh, hopeful, hopefully for another 30 pounds so that each uh, student, there are eight students, each student can come away with uh, you know several pounds of high carbon steel of which to work make something. So I have blacksmiths in the class, I have people who are uh, interested in metallurgy, uh, I have sculptors, um, bladesmiths, uh, people are interested in um, their, uh, experimental archaeology, people who like to do reproduce uh, ancient technologies. Uh, so that's a little bit about the class.